what's up youtube welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel how you do how you been and my mouth is gold shorty says she like my teeth okay forever ever you would never tell a lie bitch forever ever i'm getting to this ride so in today's video um i'm going to be trying on everything in my closet so the main purpose of today's video is to get rid of the stuff that I'm literally never gonna wear. And if you've been on my channel before, then you know that I did a cleaning out my closet video and I think I threw away like two full garbage bags of clothes or might've been one full garbage bag of clothes, but I still basically wear like the same outfits and I recycle them to make new outfits with each other. Like it's a lot of clothes that I still don't wear. And since I've been going to the gym for the past few months, it's a lot of clothes that I cannot fit cause your girl, your girl getting thick. She getting thick, you know. So yeah, um, <laughs> it's a lot of clothes that I actually need to throw away. Well, I'm not gonna throw them away. I'm gonna try to sell them on Depop, but I'm going to tell y'all where I got it from if I can remember, cause a lot of these clothes are old. And I'm just gonna tell you if I'm keeping it or if I'm selling it. So yeah, let's get started. Um, I basically grabbed all my jeans. Okay, so I got my dresses. Um, honestly, I don't expect, it's not that many but it's a lot for me for a person who does not wear dresses like at all i think i wear a dress like once every year okay so this dress oh, come on do what you're supposed to do this dress came from urban outfitters as you can see from the bag that i literally never took it out of that just shows you that i've never worn this dress in my life but to try it on in the store so yeah this is what it fit like it's kind of like it's kind of like weird right here i guess i'm supposed to have more hips but i don't it's really nothing i can do about that um i liked how it fit in the store but now looking at it like looking at this extra fabric that clearly says i'm supposed to have hips but i don't i think i'm just gonna give it away because i've had this dress for probably like a year maybe maybe almost a year and i've never even took it out the bag so i'm gonna give it away because it's just been sitting there doing nothing. Okay, so most of these dresses you've probably seen before if you watch my videos, like this one. This one was in my Shein summer haul from last summer. I don't wear this. I have not worn this. I wore this one, the green one. I'm not gonna put it on just because, I mean, if you really wanna see it, you can go watch my other video from last summer with this dress in it. But I'm not about to put this on right now. Um. Honestly, I don't think I'm gonna keep this one. I think I'm gonna get this one away. Just because when I when I wore it, it was cool, but like it wasn't really the kind of the, the look that would make me want to wear it again. But since I have not worn this one, um I think I'm gonna keep this one. Just because I haven't worn it, just so I can wear it at least once. So okay, so this one also came from Shein. If you saw that video, then you would know that. Um I liked this dress when I first saw saw it but now like having it on again i'm not too crazy about it so i think i'm gonna give it away just because i'm probably never gonna wear it because i haven't worn it in a year so i'm just gonna give it away i got this dress from a boutique in new york when i was living there that's how old it is i think this dress is like five four years old and i think i've only worn it like once and it's really cute and that's why i haven't given it away i mean yeah that's why i haven't given it away it's got a little split right here like it's just a cute like basic dress i just don't wear it because i don't wear dresses but i like to keep it around because if i had a reason to wear a dress i would wear this dress okay here's another dress that i got from that same boutique i'm pretty sure um this is the famous dress of mine that still has the tag on it i got this like four or five years ago guys and it still has the tag on it so what does that tell you the main reason i haven't worn this dress is basically because if i wear it like my whole everything is out here um like if i turn to the side like everything is out i'm gonna keep it just because like i don't know I might have like a girl's night out or something. I don't know, and it might be cute to wear. Or... I don't know, you never know when you might need a little black dress, you feel me? So I'm gonna keep this one. Okay, so this dress is, where did this come from? This came from Ragstock. I had this color and then I also had this color, but like I told y'all before, maroon stopped being my color a long time ago, so I kinda just threw away all my maroon clothes. Um, This is just a basic like, bodycon type of dress it comes to my knees 
because I used to only shave to my knees. So I used to only buy dresses that would only show underneath my knees because I wasn't shaving none of this because it just, it was too much work. I have not worn this dress in like three years. Bro, my thighs are sweating right now. This is the main reason why I don't wear dresses because I don't like the feeling of my thighs touching each other and sweating. Like I don't like it. But I probably just give this one away just because I don't wear it and I know I'm not going to wear it because it's been in my closet for like three years, so yeah. Okay, so this is a dress that I actually spent like a decent amount of money on just because I bought it for an event that I had to go to but I ended up wearing the other thing to that event. So I've never worn this dress, even though the tags are off, I've never worn it. It's just like been in my closet waiting for me to find some place to wear this. Um. I don't know, part of me wants to keep it, but then like another part of me is like, girl, you ain't never gonna wear that dress. Like, what are you holding on to it for? I think I'm gonna give it away just because I don't think I'm ever gonna wear it. And I feel like if I do have another event to go to, knowing me, I'm probably just gonna go to the store and look for another dress, to be honest. Okay, so this, <laughs> I feel like y'all can tell where this dress came from, judging by how excited I am to show y'all. But this is a dress that I made from a t-shirt that I got from a thrift store down the street from my house. And I really like it. Like, it's really cute. Like, it's unique. You ain't gonna see nobody else with this, obviously, because I made it out of a t-shirt. Once again, I didn't wear dresses because my legs, I just... Like, my thing with my hairy legs is they don't bother me. But I don't, I didn't like to wear skirts and dresses because they bothered other people. And I'm like, I don't want to hear you complain. Like, I don't want to hear you talk about it. Like, it's not bothering me. Why are you talking about it? Oh, your legs are so hairy. Oh, why don't you shave it? Like, why are you worried about my legs? So that's really the only reason why I really didn't like wear shorts and dresses like that. Because it really didn't bother me. But like, I mean, now that I get waxes no one's being bothered so i might actually decide to wear this dress one day even though it is really kind of short and it rises up when i move but it's like so like this this dress is so cute y'all like this dress is so cute to me and i at least want to take a picture in it or something so i'm definitely gonna keep this because this is my baby you know because i made it so yeah i'm keeping this okay this is a dress that i got from i have no idea i didn't read the tag yeah this is just another like super long dress that I used to wear because I did not like shaving above my knee. It's cool, like it's cute, but once again, this isn't really my color anymore. Maybe it's good to twerk in because of the stripes though. <laughs> oh, we gonna edit that out. Um, anyway, I think I'm gonna give it away just because I haven't worn it and I don't think I am gonna wear it. So yeah, it can go. Okay, y'all, this dress. Oh, I did not pick it all the way up in the back. Okay, this dress I bought years ago, like, five or six years ago I think and I bought this dress around the same time that I bought my very first item from Shein like that's how old this dress is and I just had to take it out of the bag do you guys want to know why I had to take it out of the bag because I've never worn this dress um <laughs> I thought that my life was gonna be completely different like I thought I was gonna be a different person so I was buying all these like out clothes like to go to clubs and bars and stuff like that and then i ended up still hating people and still hating going outside so i ended up with all these clothes like this that i just never wore so i just been holding on to this because it's cute and like you never know like maybe i'll have an all white party or something to go to i'm gonna keep holding on to this until I use it and then probably after I use it, that's when I'm gonna give it away. Okay, so I got all these dresses that I'm giving away. I'm only keeping one, two, three, four. I'm only keeping, oh, five. I'm only keeping five dresses just because I don't wear dresses like that. So there's really no reason for me to have like 10 dresses. But yeah, that's it for this video. If you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Because if you're not subscribed, what are you doing? Also, since you didn't subscribe, you might as well click the notification bell so you'll be notified of the video because I know you want to see this video, so I know you're going to see my next video, so you might as well keep the ball rolling. I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. She said be humble, but I'm not. Thanks a lot. Yeah, ain't forever, ever. You would never tell a lie, bitch, forever, ever. They gonna like it and subscribe.